हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ईसी एकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड टाइम रिवर्सल प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ डीएफटी लेट अस राइट द स्टेटमेंट फर्स्ट इफ डीएफटी ऑफ एक्स ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू कैपिटल एक्स ऑफ के देन वी कैन राइट डीएफटी ऑफ x of minus n mod n which will be equal to x of n minus n will be equal to capital x of minus k with mod n that can be written as capital x of capital n minus k so here x of minus n mod n represents the time reversal of x of n so time reversal operation of x of n can be represented like this so we can write this as x of n minus n this we understood in our previous topic where we can add mod value with this n value so if we add mod value with this n value it will be the n minus n so that is what we have written here so if we take the dft of time reversal signal then we should get x of minus k with mod n that is same as n minus k so we can write this equation as x of n minus k let us prove this proof let us take this value we will take the dft of x of n minus n will be equal to summation of n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n minus n into e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into k n this is similar to the formula of dft instead of x of n we have written it as x of n minus n so in place of x of n we have written it as x of n minus n now let us put m is equal to capital n minus n so from this we can write small n will be equal to capital n minus m now in this lower summation if we put n is equal to 0 at that case we will get m is equal to n and in upper summation n value is n minus 1 if we put n minus 1 here so it will be m will be equal to n minus n plus 1 so we can cancel out these two so we can say m will be equal to 1 so in the lower summation value will be n and per value of the summation will be equal to 1 now we'll write the above equation as summation of m is equal to n to 1 x of m because n minus n is m so we'll write that one here into e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n to k in place of small n we will write n minus m now we can write this equation as summation of we can interchange the summation value we can take the summation value as 1 to n m is equal to 1 to n so you can take summation from n to 1 it is same as taking summation from 1 to n x of m into we can split this exponential term so we can write e to the power of j 2 pi by n into k m because m is having negative value minus multiplied with minus it will be plus so it will be e to the power of j 2 pi by n into k m into e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into k capital n if we cancel out these two n so we will be left out with e to the power of minus j 2 pi into k so this value will always be equal to 1 so this value will always be equal to 1 that's why we can write this equation as summation of m is equal to 1 to n x of m into e to the power of j 2 pi by n into k m into we are having 1 in place of 1 we will write a new term which is e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into n m now this value 
is nothing but 1. So, instead of 1, we have written this value. If you cancel out n n, so the remaining term will be e to the power of minus j 2 pi into m. So, that value will be equal to 1. So, instead of 1, we have written this term. So, we can write this equation as summation of m is equal to 0 to n minus 1. So, if we start from 1, it will be up to n. If we start from previous value m is equal to 0, we can write this as n minus 1. So, that is what we have written here m value is from 0 to n minus 1 x of m. In these two term, we can take e to the power of minus j 2 pi n as common. So, it will be e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into we can write this value capital N. So, for this we can write it as minus k into m. This is similar to the formula of d of t. So, here in place of x of k we are writing the value as n minus k. So, we can write in place of k the value is n minus k. So, that is why we can write this as x of n minus k. So, we can say this equation will be equal to x of n minus k towards left hand side it is d of t of x of n minus n. So, this term we can write it as x of minus k with mod n. This is the time reversal property of d of t. Hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.